What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Pac, man. You and Pac World, Pac Nation, stand up. And I just want to say, man, the Lakers did it. Hey, look, y'all know I'm not no bandwagon jumper. I rep the Lakers all day, every day. Kobe Bryant was and always will be the GOAT in my eyes. So, y'all know this ain't just some hype. I know I see several other YouTubers today. Oh, Congratulations to the, to the Lakers, dude. And before that, y'all wasn't saying none of that. Half y'all was hoping they lose sometime. But I'm just saying, man, I just want to say, y'all know, true Laker fans, stand up. Just saying, everybody that represents Laker Nation, stand up. Laker fans, stand up. Even the LeBron James fans, because now he a Laker. If you're a real Laker fan, at one time, at one point in your life, you hated LeBron. So, let's get that out of the way right now. At one time, I hated LeBron because I was a Kobe fan. I was a diehard Kobe fan. But now he's part of the Lakers, so I got to embrace him. So, LeBron James, salute to you. Proud of you. AD, Dwight Howard, Rondo, everybody, man. Kyle Kuzma, look, man, salute. And also, salute to Jimmy Butler and the Miami Heat, man. Y'all made it there, so I can't take nothing from you. But, like I said, Lakers, we did it. But, today, man, we're here to talk about a sneaker that's slated to drop on October 31st. But before we do that, hit that subscribe button. And do me a favor, hit that notification bell so you receive all the dope content that we drop over here Pack World Kicks. And drop a like on the jump for the one time for your boy, a hey, Pack Nation. I know y'all can get this video up to 100 likes in a couple days. So if you watch this video, take a second out right now. Hit that like button and drop a comment. Let me know if you was excited for the Lakers winning. Or also drop a comment on which sneaker you're going to cop on the 31st as well. But before we go any further, I got to announce the winner of this month of September giveaway. And the winner is... Mandarin 420. So I will be hitting up on IG to, you know, say get the address and everything from you, bro. I'm gonna DM you. So we get the address so I can mail you that fifty dollar Visa gift card. But congratulations to you. Salute to you, and you're the winner of the month September giveaway. But like I said, today we're here to talk about a sneaker that stayed to drop on October 31st was two of them. And uh, most time we'd be like, oh, it's two sneakers dropping. One of them got to get pushed back. But last week just showed us that's not always true. Because last week, everybody was talking about, oh, one of these things got pushed back, either Air Jordan 3, Varsity Royal, or the PSG 4. And they didn't push neither one of them back. They let them fly. And that showed Jordan Brand right there that you could drop two hype sneakers on the same day, and they both would do very, very well. So I want to see if October 31st, the day I let both of these niggas still stay there and sit on the app and see if both of these sneakers will do what they're going to sell out. So, but we're going to see if Jordan Brown will let that stay. I don't know. I think they should just to test the waters because you know they're going to sell out. It's going to be crazy and people will be busting heads for them joints and everything. And I, I, I want both of them. It doesn't matter for retail or resale. I got to have them. They both got in my collection. Those dark the um, Jordan 1 Dark Mochas, I got to get them. That's already in talks of being Jordan 1 of the year right now. And that's crazy. Because there have been a lot of other dope Jordan 1s that dropped this year. And we'll get to that in a later video. We'll drop all the, the hype Jordan 1s this year. And probably give you like my top five. But that's for another video. But this sneaker right here also can be in the running. For that, so we have two sneakers that could be fighting for Jordan One of the Year, dropping on the same day, and that is the Air Jordan One High OG COJP Midnight Navy. This sneaker is fire, fire! I'm telling you, it released on October 31st, 2020, and it's coming in for a retail price of 170, and it's worth every bit of it. This sneaker is. Fire. Gotta have it. This sneaker, I gotta have it. Like I had to have the um the Tokyo, I gotta have 
that midnight navy. That's a must cop. No matter what, I gotta go get it. But this sneaker was originally released in 2001, and it was a Japan exclusive only. And see, that also adds to the hype. Because true sneakerheads know this sneaker, you can get it back in the day. Unless you paid that high resale to get it from Cross Seas. But now, they're releasing them here. And for all the OG sneaker collectors, now is their time to get their hands on it. So that's going to put that hype through the roof right there. So... That's what make this sneaker right here real hard to cop. But let's get into a little review of this sneaker, man, and let y'all know how the sneakers come in the colorways and all the materials and everything. So let's jump right into that. This is going to have a navy blue, I mean a midnight navy blue bottom, the outsole, which I think is dope because they just didn't do black or white. They did the midnight navy. And then it has a white midsole. Then on that upper, it has an all-white upper with midnight navy overlays and a silver swoosh and wings logo, a metallic silver swoosh and wings logo to end that off right there. And that's going to be fire. And then on that tongue, that comes in white with that midnight navy Nike Air embroidered on there with, um, with those blue rope laces on there. It also, it comes just like this tongue is right here, but instead of the gray, you have that white tongue with that midnight navy Nike Air in Boston there. Fire. And also behind that, you're going to have this tag as well. 2001 to 2020 behind the tongue of those midnight navies also. And then on the inside of the sneaker, you're going to have that Midnight Navy insole in with that COJP, with that uh, Jordan symbol on the insole as well. This nigga is all around fire. I'm telling you. But in the comment section below, tell me what y'all think. Because y'all know my thoughts on it. But I want to know y'all thoughts. What do you think? Is this something you want to cop? Is this something you just go pass on? Are you going for those dark mochas? Or... You need both of them. Are you like me? You need both. I need both of these. So on the 31st, I hope they both drop. So just take my money. I'm just going to hand you my wallet and my credit card. Just do what you want to do with it. But I'm telling y'all, man, this sneaker is a must cop for me. So, but comment, down, comment in the section below and tell me what y'all think. This is a must cop. Or is it not? Or you just will skip past it. And get on to the next one. And also in the comment section below, tell me what y'all think about them Lakers. Did you, what do you think about the game? Was it exciting to you? Did you think they could have changed something? Let's just have a little discussion about that as well in the comment section below. So comment, I'll talk back. You know, let's get a discussion going on about the Lakers game and about the sneakers. Which one are you will go for on the 31st? If they, if they choose to release both of these sneakers on the same day. And I think they should. And also, do you think they should? But man, you and Pac, man, you and Pac World, Pac Nation, stand up. And man, y'all know our motto, stay blessed, stay prayed up, and stay safe out there. Like I said, man, I'm at 420. Salute, congratulations on the, on the one of the giveaway. I just want to say, I love each and every one of y'all. Until the next one, peace.